the pixel extended version here is the 4.1 which is currently the latest available security patch level here is 5th of january and the kernel we get here is the radcliffe kernel now moving back these is this is the settings page and overall ui here is pretty much smooth the launcher here is good smooth the quick settings everything here so far is running smooth and perfectly fine this is the new like a bit of redesigned android 12 google feed so yeah let's take a look at the settings and the system these are the options available and in the gestures we get to see the quick tap now available as you can see when i double tap as you can see quick tap de detected and you can set the actions like take screenshots play or pause media or anything like let's just double tap the back as you can see it take the screenshot and it is just great it works each and every time so no issues you, yeah i just like this one this feature here is was just great and as you can see this is what it gets sometimes like this is a bug present here this is what it happens and you can just wait and it will just work perfectly fine so i have i have set to take screenshots and it just works fine as you can see so this is how it works we get to see the quickly open camera the system navigation the one-handed mode here is also available as you can see it is working fine okay then moving back the lift to check phone here this is the feature available but it's not working as usual the swipe to screenshot option the double tap to check phone this is working fine okay then moving back to the other settings we get to see the digital well-being available which works fine the security here everything works fine the screen lock here is available the fingerprint scanner here is working perfectly fine as you can see no issues the fingerprint scanner is working the face unlock here is still not available in the advanced settings these are the options we get smart lock and everything sim card lock and the phone has been encrypted if you flash this wrong so yes now moving back uh, to the wallpaper and style these are the options available and we also get to see the theming the themed icons this is how it looks and if you want to turn it off then you can turn it off from here then the basic colors you can set whatever the theming options you want you can adjust the app grid from here so yes now moving back the display options these are all the same options nothing here is new everything here is similar to a all the other android 12 roms the minimum refresh rate and maximum refresh rate here is available if you want to change you can set change it from here the minimum refresh rate you can change so it will switch to 90 and 120 from here then the double tap to wake here is working the icon shape icon pack you can set like just say oxygen os you can change the icon pack of the quick settings as you can see these the icons these are the icon packs you can change not the home screen icon packs now talking about the battery backup the battery backup here on this room here is a bit issue i'll show you the battery usage so from 84 percent to 54 percent i got one hour and 23 minutes of screen on time and from 81 percent to 19 percent the screen on time was 3 hours and 5 minutes. So the battery backup on this room here is average and currently I am using this room at 90 hertz. So at 90 hertz this is the battery backup and as another example you can see 87% to 20% battery drain, 3 hours and 45 minutes of screen on time. So yes you can be, you will get average battery backup not that good. But the another issue here is the standby battery drain here is a bit problem here. Overnight, the phone drains around 6 to 7 percent of battery. So, yeah, the overnight battery drain here is the issue, the standby battery drain. So, yeah, which has been an issue I'm facing. Talking about the customizations, here are the options the snow house, these are all the customizations options available, the status bar items and everything. Then, in the lock screen, these are the options double tap uh, to sleep on lock screen then these are the navbar gesture peels and everything customization the vibrate on connect then these are the hardware options the advanced reboot option and everything 
these were the customizations not much now going to the home screen this is the pixel launcher available here which is fluid and smooth no issues with here the quick settings here is working fine the refresh rate toggle here is missing otherwise everything here is great the screen recorder here is available these are the options available for the screen recorder now talking about the camera the default camera we get here is this shitty one there's nothing here and the gcam 8.0 here is working perfectly fine so which i'll suggest you to use as you saw that lag this lag comes when you go out of the camera or when he's talking about the safety net status the safety net status here has passed and all the banking apps everything here is running perfectly fine google pay paytm everything talking about the geekbench scores the scores are here impressive and compared to other android 12 roms these scores are impressive 519 and 1438 so yeah and overall performance also here is just great smooth fluid no stutters or lags anywhere in the rom in the ui everything just works fine so yeah then talking about the drm info we get to see the wide mind l1 secure level so everything just works fine the 1080p full hd videos this was it now talking about the bugs i'll show you some screenshots here as you can see here this screenshot of the status bar you can see this is what it gets sometimes this is the bug with the quick settings this has happened only once in my usage i'm using this from around one week now this has happened only once but this is a bug present here so yes this was it for the bugs and also i have once i had faced the random reboot bug like the phone just automatically got switched off and restart rebooted so this was the bug i had faced the random reboot bug was present like i had faced only once but it's there so yeah that is it for now if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to hit the like button if you are new to this channel then please guys subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions then you can ask me in the comment section below or in the telegram group i'll meet you in the next one till then stay safe have fun and bye